Hi, this is Inchies. I'm Code. Uh, I'm gonna do Karen campaign number two. Unfortunately, I have to redo it because the sound didn't come through. So let's do it. Okay, objective is to eradicate, eradicate the alien infestation and Rainer must survive. So let's do it. Okay, so this is Rainer. Again, he's in his vulture. SCVs, mineral patches. You want to build SCVs and hotkey your command center. Also hotkey your barracks. So I push my hotkey and go directly to it. So marines, build a couple of those and let's scatter out the area. Something new that I've noticed is the Terran buildings. Um, you see command center, supply depots, barracks, and engineering bay. Well, the engineering bay is for upgrades, such as... Hold on. Uh, such as weapon upgrades for units such as these. Biological units, like marines. Very near, stop moving. Um, you know how its damage says 6? Ghost rifle says 6. Well, up an upgrade gives you plus 1. Or plus two, depending on the engineering bay. But it heads up, such as by a four, four times six is twenty-four. So they do twenty-four damage per shot. But with the upgrades, let's say eight, four times eight is thirty-two. That's eight more damage than what it, what it's supposed to do. So it does add up in the long run. So it does help if you have upgrades. Let's go back, get some more, let's build a refinery. I think you can actually beat this mission without, without, with just marines. I'm pretty sure of that. Let's explore up here. Okay, so the thing about Zerg is they can overwhelm you in numbers. Looks like the ground there is alive. They have they can build a ton of units, crap ton of units, in a couple minutes. Let's just say that. Well Terran, you actually have to um, build a ton of buildings and build units. So Zerg is pretty pretty good if you know how to use it correctly. But Terran, it's more of... Terran's more of build units that are okay, but are also good at the same time. Like SCVs, they're really good because they can repair. So it's just like, I want to repair... I want to repair Rainer. I can repair his vehicle. And buildings too, but the thing I don't like about Terran is their buildings burn down really fast. And when their buildings burn down, they destroy. They're destroyed. So that's what sucks. So I'll keep my army. So yeah, uh, Marines, they're, they're pretty OP in numbers. Okay, now... Oh, that's right. The CompSat station is... Hold on, let me build up my other command center. CompSat station is... Uh, I would say... It's like a scanner sweep. It is a scanner sweep, basically, for... If, if you ever played StarCraft 2. It's a scanner sweep that allows you to scan the area. So I'll, I'll show you once my um, thing is finished. Yeah, so fire bats, they're really, they're really nice. They do 16 damage per shot against biological units. And... No, I forgot to build... Oops. Let's build an engineering bay. Okay, let's check out the commsat station. Okay, so you can you can sweep. Like I want to sweep here, 
Oh, that shows that that shows the area. So it just shows the basic area, which is nice. Now, let's build a couple more units. Oh, this is an academy. An academy, you can upgrade your units with academies, such as um, the shells, which allow the fire more, or attack range. Haha, <laughs> gives you more attack range. And stim pack also helps a lot. It gives you boost speed and attack for marines and fire bats. Which is also really nice, so they can fire faster. Okay, now let's... Nope, got it wrong. Vultures have the ability of spider mines. Which are mines in the ground that do a lot of damage. And I'm probably going to die from this attack, so let's pull back. And attack. Build more units. Scan sweep this area. Nothing. Okay. The thing about Zerg is their numbers, like I said before. Um, another race called Protoss, if you don't know already. Protoss goes by technology. They go by really nice tech. And Terran is just in the middle. Oh, I forgot. The engineering bay can lift up. That's new. Or old. New. Same thing. Spider-Mans do 125 damage. And they do splash. So that's the good thing about them. Now this is crazy. This is very crazy. Upgrading. Let's get stim pack. Supply caps. Okay, so this thing is not burning yet. Let's make it burn. Okay, so normally Terran units burn because they are low health, but this unit does not burn. This is crazy. It regenerates health. But the insane thing is I need to build a couple more units. Okay. So let's say I'm attacking this barracks. I mean bunker, bunker. Sorry, bunker. And it starts lighting on fire. Suddenly turns red. Okay. In red it starts to burn slowly. But in this case it doesn't for this infested command center because it's organic and you can only make this by a queen um, if you infest while it's red but it's really difficult to do but these the units that that this this thing makes is OP they make they make like kamikaze soldiers that oh okay they make kamikaze soldiers that do, I think, 200 damage, splash, like a spider mine, but more damage. So that's one really, really nice thing about Zerg. Um, so yeah, this mission's done. Almost done. Once they finish talking. So basically this guy right here, he's Edmund Duke, uh, he's the leader of NORAD 2, the general leader of the Confederate Army. He places Jim Rayner under arrest because he didn't follow orders and he went to go save um, a colony. But they don't think it's a good thing that he did abandon his post to help save this these people. So yeah, this is Sunny Cheese. I'm Code. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.